Hi, this is John Moskonis with your One Minute Career Checkup. Today I'd like to speak with you about working with, your, with a recruiter and understanding the obligations of a recruiter. You know, the obligation of a recruiter to his client is twofold. One is to deliver a short slate of qualified candidates. And secondly, the obligation to the client is to manage any red flags that the, that the recruiter might notice with the candidates. So, for instance, don't necessarily offer up to your recruiter the idea that you've been on seven interviews over the last three months, but not one of these interviews has turned into a job offer because the recruiter is going to wonder if there might be a problem with your ability to sit down across from someone and communicate your value proposition. Don't share with a recruiter that you plan to go out and start working with three other recruiters because that will certainly interfere with the recruiter's obligation to the client to pe put people in front of the client who are committed to looking at this job very seriously. When you're following through with the recruiter, please don't call him or her every three weeks and, and say, hey, you got anything? They know you're around. You're on their radar screen. But instead, find some creative ways to stay in touch with the recruiter, like sending them some industry articles, for instance, or at least give them a referral or two, or, or two of someone that, th that you might know who might fit for their job. Believe me, if you start to build a relationship, start to build a friendship, your recruiter will think of you first. I'm John Moskonis with your One Minute Career Checkup. We'll see you next time.